morning. After a full day of deliberations, the jury did not come back with a verdict. It's the federal tax fraud trial of Orleans District Attorney Jason Williams and WGNO's Kenny Lopez is at federal court downtown. Kenny. That's right, Kern Susie, and now we wait. Around 4.30 this afternoon, Judge Lance Afric came into the courtroom and he told everybody that the jury would be retiring for the day, which means they come back bright and early tomorrow morning, 8.30, to continue their deliberations. Now, to give you a recap, in closing arguments yesterday, prosecutors tried to prove that Jason Williams and Nicole Burdett were the ones calling all the shots when it came to tax preparer Henry Timothy fudging their tax. Prosecutors said the three of them all worked together, say the three of them were birds of a feather who cheated together. Nicole Burdett's defense attorney, Michael Magner, called Mr. Timothy a sociopath and a liar that couldn't be trusted. The defense said he lied about being a CPA and Williams and Burdett trusted him. The defense told jurors that prosecutors did not present enough hard evidence that Williams and Burdett acted willfully and knowingly in regards to tax fraud. The defense argued that if Williams and Burdett had a conspiracy of cheating the government, why would they be willingly give all their documents and expense reports without hiding anything? Williams and Burdett faced 10 counts jointly on tax fraud and conspiracy, as well as 10 counts in regards to, not 10 counts, four counts in regards to cash payments of $10,000 or more in which proper tax forms were not filled out. Now, the jury must decide whether they are guilty without reasonable doubt. And let me tell you, this is serious for Williams because if he's found guilty on even one charge, that means he'll lose his law license, which means he won't be able to be district any attorney anymore. Once again, the jury continues their deliberations tomorrow morning right here at federal court at 830.